Yeah, let's go, baby. Hey guys, it's Lauren. In this video, I decided to run three miles every day for a week. I don't know why I decided to do this. I guess I kind of just wanted to see what would happen to my body and like my health. I'm filming this afterwards, so I already know what happened, but here are the befores. And I'm gonna show you guys the afters after I do it. I hope you guys enjoy and let's start the challenge. Yeah, yeah. really pale but I just got back from my run it actually went really good there's not much to update on because it's day one so obviously there's not gonna be results but it felt really good to run again hey guys so it is day two I'm on the way I feel super good I'm just kind of tired today Hi, Teddy. <laughs> so far this has been going good but it's also only been two days so yeah, let's go run are you ready to run no I think I'm gonna throw up are you gonna walk? Oh, are you ready to run? Are you ready to run? Are you ready to he run? He said yes. <laughs> Told my brothers one day we gonna make it. We just finished running our three miles. It was really good. It was a lot easier than yesterday, I think. Yeah, let's go, baby. Okay, so I just got to Rose Bowl. It's day three. I honestly was not gonna come today just because I felt so unmotivated. I just wanted to come here today because I committed to this challenge, so I wanted to actually go through with it. We just gotta grind for that paycheck. Mama told me one day I'll be famous. Remember when she used to say she hate us. That ended with life. Hey guys, so it's day four. Sorry for the mess. I've literally been through it today. I was literally sitting on the floor crying. But I'm about to go on my run. When I say shit, now I'm inside all them people's playlists. So one day I'll be stomping on all stage. Okay, it's literally 10.30, but I forgot to film, but I finished. Yeah, we did 3.7 miles today. I'm about to go on my run. I feel really good about it. I'm really excited, actually. Let's go. There's something about the way that you... Hi, oh wow, I literally look like a tomato. I just finished my run, literally like a minute ago. Wow, I am so surprised because I just ran that in 28 minutes and I literally have never ran three miles in 28 minutes. That means that there's improvement happening. I guess physically inside my body, there's something happening. Wow, I look really bad right now. <laughs> Super excited to continue this challenge. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Bye. We don't need a rush and we don't need to make you say pace yourself, so it down. Okay guys, so now the challenge is over. The first thing I'm going to talk about is how it went. At the beginning it went really well, but around like day three or four, I started to get like unmotivated to do it and I kind of just like didn't want to do it altogether, but I was able to push through and I still went consecutively every day. Around that time was also when I personally noticed the biggest improvements. I noticed that I was able to run the three miles a lot faster than the first few days. So there was definitely things inside my body that were happening and like my muscles were getting stronger and my stamina was just getting a lot better. So another thing that I noticed throughout this challenge is that it was harder for me to run personally when I ate something bad throughout the day. Even if I waited like a few hours after I ate, if I ate something bad like really sugary or like junk food when I was running, I would get more cramps. This challenge also motivated me to eat healthier because of said reason that I just said. <laughs> the next thing that I noticed would actually be my energy levels. If you don't work out a lot, you would think that running three miles every single day would kind of drain your energy but I actually strangely got more energy and if I would run during the day after I showered and everything I would still have enough energy to complete all of the rest of the work for the day okay so now the part you guys are all waiting for is the after results so here are my afters and I'm gonna put them with my before and afters
first I want to clarify something I don't weigh myself I don't like weighing myself I don't like comparing my body towards a number I know a lot of people weigh themselves for progress and everything but I just don't really like it it makes me like a slave to the scale I guess but I'm not gonna tell you guys how much I lost or gained because I don't really know that for sure myself what I can tell you guys is that I definitely got more toned if you guys couldn't tell from the before and afters I definitely got more toned and I feel like my stomach got a little bit flatter I feel like running really helps with my bloating because I bloat really easily when I eat. Whenever I would run, it would kind of help my bloating for the day. I definitely think this week has changed my body. Not like drastically because obviously it's just a week and it was only seven days of running three miles but my body did definitely change a really good amount. I personally really love this challenge. I really recommend you guys try it because it increases your motivation to work out for one. It increases your energy. You learn self-control and consistency Especially if you're bored in quarantine right now, I mean, why not try this challenge? It might turn out to be really fun for you and you might really enjoy it and actually continue for longer than just a week. Even if you don't like running, I feel like you'll definitely learn to like running. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoy. Let me know if you decide to do it. Let me know how it goes. I love every single one of you guys and I hope you guys stick around to watch my next videos.